2021 keeps rolling and I keep going through walkthroughs for you guys. So uh, based on requests, I'm doing the Calcutta Conquest this week. Uh, was released in January of 2021 and has a ton of new features. So let's get to it. When you first look at the Calcutta Conquest, you're going to realize right away it's an all-metal reel. And that is the Hagane body. So Hagane side plate, metal side plate, metal frame. The other thing you're going to notice with it is it's got the S-Compact body, which it was introduced a few years ago. I remember it in the Calcutta D when it first came out. That was my first experience with S-Compact body. But for you, if you're wondering what it does, it's basically, you could tell, it's got a drop-down gearbox on the cranking side. On the handle side, it's full size. But on the palming side is where the S compact body comes into play, where it's a reduced palming size. So the plate on the side is small, it fits in your hand comfortably, it does not fatigue you like traditional beer can style reels. When we get into the guts of the reel, right away 13 plus 1 SARB bearings, shielded anti-rust bearings in the Calcutta Conquest. The other thing you're going to notice when you first spin the handle, it's got micro module gear, so that finer tooth on the gear so the gear and the pinion they mesh better there's more contact more teeth touching at the same time more smoothness more transmission of power more longevity silent tune is basically we get a very very quiet very powerful very smooth reel lastly in the newest addition to the calcutta conquest is infinity drive now infinity drive is really an impressive thing and it was first seen in the oshia jigger reels from shimano now what this does for you as an angler is it offers far more power more sensitivity and smoother cranking than the previous 2014 Conquest. Essentially, even under load, this reel is able to have that power, smoothness and drive. And that is exactly what Infinity Drive does with the new 2021 Calcutta Conquest. When we look at the casting performance of this reel, you're going to know right away that this reel is going to perform in a variety of situations. S3D spool and super free spool, two of Shimano's tried and true technologies to help with casting, but there's a couple other things that are really going to make a big difference. MGL3 spool. MGL3 spool is basically a super lightweight but incredibly strong spool that has very little mass to it. Whenever you get a heavy spool, it's not good at casting light baits because it takes a lot of weight to get that thing moving, to get that spool spinning because it's heavy. MGL3 spool is really all about low startup inertia. So if you're really into casting light baits like an eighth or a quarter or a sixteenth or you know 32nd, this is going to handle it perfectly. So this reel is really designed to cast the widest range of baits incredibly easily, uh, accurately and good distance. So that's MGL3 spool. And to help fine tune the casting, SVS Infinity is also part of this reel. So SVS Infinity, when you open the side plate, you'll notice there's four brake pads on it that can be clicked on or off. So on would be when they're flat, off would be when you click them up. But then that's adjustable from the outside without having to open the spool. So no matter the situation you're in, if you're cat facing a headwind when you turn the corner on a bank, you can crank it up to maximum. And what that's going to do is push the race down and force those to stay open or out. That's going to give you the most casting control. You come around a lee of the wind, and you, or you have it to your back, and you want more casting distance, you can reduce it by turning it towards minimum. And that's going to allow those flaps to go up and down. So when you cast, and your spool is at the height of its speed right off the bat, it's going to give you the most control. Those centrifugal force is going to bring those paddles out. But then as that spool speed starts to drop, as the lure starts to slow, they'll retract and allow it to go further. So, SVS Infinity, MGL3 spool, S3D spool, and Super Free spool. All going to help with casting. So when we talk about the specs of Calcutta Conquest for the new 2021, there's a few things we want to go through. So, models. There's only three. There is a right-handed 100 size, and there are two 200 sizes. Both 200, which is right-handed, and 201, that's for lefties. When we look at the drag, 9 pounds of drag on the 100 size, and 13 pounds of drag on the 200 size, and they come with the cross-carbon drag. Cross carbon drag is a material that allows for hard running fish, it dissipates heat, and it really withstands those hard charging fish really, really well. For the weight of the reel, 7.8 ounces for the 100 size and 8.3 ounces for the 200 size, which is really impressive when you consider the fact that this is an all metal reel. The one area you really want to focus on is the gear ratio and the inches of line per handle turn. 
7.4 to 1 for the 100 size, which brings in a whopping 30 inches of line per handle turn for a very small reel. But where things really change is when you go to the 200 size. 4.8 to 1, 22 inches of line per handle turn. Now how this affects you? It depends on what techniques you really want to use Calcutta Conquest for. For me, as a bass fisherman, I already know cranking and topwater, like walking a dog on any of topwater baits. Something along those lines is going to work. Slow rolling a spinner bait, uh, slow moving a swim bait or swimming it through the water column. All of these things are going to do really well with that 22 inches of line per handle turn. Because really, it's equivalent to like a 5 to 1 bait cast reel in low profile. But it's also going to play really well on the West Coast where so many people love these reels for swinging spoons or drifting floats in the bigger rivers and tributaries out in the West Coast for both salmon and steelhead. So this reel is really going to handle a number of situations whether you're casting, cranking, throwing swim baits for conventional bass or you're fishing rivers. Well, there you have a very detailed walkthrough of the Calcutta Conquest for 2021. And I almost forgot there is one feature that probably is my favorite. It's exciting drag sound. Uh, whenever we fish, I'm so accustomed to getting excited when you hear a hard running fish on a spinning reel. The best thing in the world is the sound of that drag screaming. Well, like the Antares low profile, Calcutta Conquest in 2021 also has exciting drag sound. Meaning that when your line is being pulled out, it has a very, very smooth soft sounding drag coming out of it. So they got a clicker on the spool basically. Unlike traditional bait cast reels that you can wind over the drag and you don't hear anything except the line whine, this will actually give you a sound much like a spinning reel. So Calcutta Conquest, $549.99 for the 100 size, $569.99 US for the 200 size. Guys, check it out. You can head to fish.shimano.com if you want to see more on this reel or head to your local retailer or do some research online. Thanks for joining me, guys. If you like this, please subscribe to my channel. I'm going to continue doing these walkthroughs of gear for you. Uh, and go check out the last ones I did. Twin Power XD if you're in the saltwater inshore game or the new Altegra for 2021, which in my pick was the sleeper of the year. Talk to you soon. Hope everybody's doing well.